Right then guys, welcome back to yet another episode of Building Bar. So you guys have been really enjoying the series recently. So we're just going to carry on with it today. Now I've made seven trades. Um, one of them hasn't sold on yet. That is this Uchan at the back. But Garstorp has indeed sold on from last episode. So we can indeed get rid of him. But we have made some profit on all of these Uchan. So I can now confirm that I've made profit on every single one of them. Just waiting for this one to sell. Picked it up for 2.6k. This up for 2.8. So we'll see if he does sell during this episode. If he doesn't, then I'm sure he would have sold on my next episode. But what we need to carry on doing is playing in Division 5, is it now? We are doing actually very well in this division, and we get to use Iniesta for the first time. So yeah, let's go. Right then, guys. So at the moment, we indeed do have a 183 rated team. This guy's got a BBVA team, but it's only 179. He's got a few non rares in there too, so we could beat him. Oh no, he's bringing the fake shots out and he's gone 1-0 up. A brilliant solo goal by Isco. That's not a good start. Not a good start. Rakitic with a chance, and there's Sandro going to be played in, Rakitic has got it back, and he scored a bloody well scream, and that's a brilliant goal from Rakitic, nothing much happened apart from two goals, and it's one all. Rakitic is going to hit one again, good save, Rakitic, oh what a save, Dongu, is Johnny on the spot, and it's two bloody one, with just ten minutes before half time, neat little build up on the right hand side with, between Arda and Rakitic, and Dongu finishes off, get in, go on Rakitic, he's in, Ivan Rakitic with a finesse shot and pen, surely. Oh, I've mucked it up. That's a bloody nightmare. Oh, and yes, in. And there's Dongu, and Dongu surely can finesse it around him. Indeed, he can. It's 3 1 before the break. And we are running riot on this team. Get in. Right, there we have it. Half time. Brilliant game from our perspective. Not so good for him. And yes, has been played in here. He's cut it back on the side. And a good save for the goalie. In! Dongu with a brilliant leap out of that. It does complete his hat trick. He's got yet another one. Wasn't really expecting it. He's just good at every aspect. And it's 4 1. Amrabat's in. And Amrabat has scored. Game on. 4 2. Could he get back into this one? I hope not. Iniesta's in. Andres Iniesta. He's pulled one across two. And Dongu does indeed have his fourth. He is knocking them in like Suarez knocks them in in real life. This guy's got an incredible goal to game ratio. And he pops up with another one there in a crucial moment. 5 2. Oh, Busquets is in. Busquets! Oh, good save. Oh, no, he's in again. He's in again. Great save. Bravo. Right, there we have it. Final whistle. What a brilliant result. Again, another three points in the division. He wasn't a bad player, but Dongu again with four goals in the game. Probably up like an absolute good beast. 8.5 rating for Iniesta, so not a bad debut for him. 1.5k yet again in the bank. So we could be ending this episode on like 110k, so we'll see how that goes. But as you can see, we are nearly saved in the division. We will hopefully make ourselves saved in the division next game. So yeah, let's get into it. But before we dive into that game, we're going to have a look at some of the player stats. So in terms of games played... As you can see here, Dongu does indeed have 43. Sergi Saka is still high up in the ranks, the man from the beginning of the season, as is Douglas and Sandro and Bravo, etc. etc. In terms of goals, Dongu storms away. Alex Vidal and Sandro to Ran Rafinha. And Rakitic has actually been pinging in some goals. He also got one last game. Assist again, Dongu dominates Rafinha then behind him with Rakitic. Rakitic having a really, really solid career for us in just 12 appearances. Yellow cards, Mascherano, Douglas, you know, it's all defenders that you expect. There's one of Rafinha actually in the field. And then in terms of red cards, as you can see, a lot of defenders. Although Alex Vidal and Sergio Sampa do pop up with them in field. Right, we're going to go like, dive into another game. Sorry for not getting my words up there. You've seen the player stats. Let's get into it. Right then, guys, same team out we've got as last time, but our opponent has not got full chemistry, mainly because he's playing a left mid at right forward with a weird hybrid. We'll see if we can beat him. Oh, Dongu, he's found Iniesta, and Iniesta makes it 1-0, a brilliant start by Barcelona. This guy's been putting up the techers, but we don't care, we robbed it off him, and the captain gets on the score sheet, on only his second appearance too. Come on. Dongu, does man over, and that man is Sandro, surely 2-0. Yes, it is, another finesse shot, another assist for Dongu. We are running right on this guy yet again. Get in. Oh, the man, the goalie has come off his line, and Jordi Alba has not scored. Hits a side net in. No, oh, he's got one. Bullshit that is. He's just Frank Vardy on the score. Fuck that. Oh, what a goal that is! I didn't know it was coming. I just slammed it into the penalty area. I was like completely silent. And Alan just nicks in there. And he makes it 3 1. I so straight when he scored, he just didn't deserve it. Look at that. Dinks over the goalie and it's 3 1. And there we have it. Half time. Another brilliant performance. The only strange thing about this one is that we haven't scored with Dongu. All three of our goals haven't been scored by the big man up front. So yeah, not a very good good show from him, but still, we're winning brilliantly. Oh, and oh, just over. Oh, go on, Dongu. First time finish shot. Flashes wide. Dongu's in. Still Dongu. And still, and Dongu 
misses. No, that's so jammy. Just misses. Oh, Turan, the goalie's off his line. Turan's caught him. He hasn't found the end product. That's twice that's happened. That's expertly done from Danny Alves. Now, Turan, please finish that goalie off. He's mugging us off here. Dongu's nicked in. Dongu now. Surely his goal. Yes, finally. Dongu hasn't scored this game. And, well, normal order is indeed restored. He didn't need to get four goals last game, so it wouldn't have mattered. But, yeah, we are now going to win this game. The game has literally just frozen, and I have honestly no idea what's going on. I'm just begging that they don't DNF me. Yes, I think he's rage quit. I think he's rage quit. Please say that's not me. Yes, it isn't me. Dongu gets the man of the match in that game, and yeah, again, 1.5k roughly. Another 4-1 victory. So yeah, we're doing absolutely fantastic in this Burning Master series. Ever since we've come back after that little break, we're doing brilliantly. Next episode, you know, if we play three games, can we win the title? I can't do the math at the moment. I don't think we can. But I'll see how many games we play next episode. Also, we may be making a signing. But for now, thank you guys for watching this video. Once the um, Uchan has leaked sold on, we would be on about 110k, which is very good indeed. But yeah, thank you guys for watching, and peace out.